picture. After eight months of not enjoying it, I started working in a wine store, then did a hotel management course, and then opened my first cafe, I think when I was 26, Australian OK. But before that, from the age of 17, I worked in the industry. I left Australia in 1989, just backpacking, I had no intention of changing my life and moving overseas, and I got to London after about six months of travelling through Europe, I met my wife-to-be after a couple of weeks in London and then worked for McDonald's for almost 20 years in the UK. And I guess from a personal point of view, it was a very rewarding experience. By the end, as I got more senior in the organisation, the hours I had to commit to work became excessive. So I was doing 70 to 80 hours a week and not seeing my kids and not seeing my wife. I knew it was time for a, for a change. Matthew wanted to join forces or we came together to create the business. One of the main rules of going into business with him was that it was all about lifestyle. But part of work is to get out into the ocean and enjoy ourselves at lunchtime. We came out the way we went, opened life together and then started franchising. What are the three beans? Coffee, because obviously we use coffee beans. Sam came up with an organic Rainforest Alliance blend for us. We spend quite a bit of time cupping different origins of coffee. Last week we literally went through, I think, 30 different origins of coffee to try and work out those beans that would make up our next blend. Vanilla represented the purity of ingredients we'd be using. We're very, very passionate about the ethics and welfare of animals, so we've searched long and hard to find free-range egg suppliers, free-range chicken, free-range bacon, also ensuring that our ingredients are free from artificial colours, flavours or preservatives. Mung, or peace, love and mung beans, you know, kind of represents our hippie natural approach to life, the surf, the beach, the whole thing. We lead a very, very different life to the one we led in the UK. I think we've got the balance right. I'm pretty sure I've got the balance right. I'm definitely not working 80 hours a week, although the phone's always on. You know, if there's ever an issue in any of the stores, the franchisees ring us directly and we'll, we'll go out at any time of day and help them fix it. The beauty of the life is that, you know, I do get to surf, I do get to be on the beach, I do get to be outdoors, which is very, very different from the UK. And it's a lot more relaxed. Sydney's a wonderful place. It's stunning.